Hi, today I have two very easy questions for you and I recommend you to stop video here, read the questions, answers and then you can uh, choose the correct answer and you can uh, run video again and compare your answer with my answer and explanation. So here is the first uh, statement. Uh, when there are three or more alleles of the specific gene, it is referred to as uh, an answer uh, C syndrome and syndrome in medicine and physiology is a collection of signs and symptoms that are observed and uh, characteristic of the single condition or disease so th this doesn't answer our statement so we have to cross out this answer and answer B mutation mutation uh, also doesn't answer uh, our statement because mutation uh, would cause uh, new alleles this is would be answer a multiply alleles series and uh, as I said mutations cause new variants of the same gene that we call alleles and sometimes uh, only uh, such alleles can be uh, different by only one nucleotide but still, uh, sometimes even one nucleotide change may cause a serious genetic disorder when um, protein that can be made from such a gene uh, can be misshaped and wouldn't function properly. So our answer here would be A. And now let me move uh, to the second uh, statement, the fact that uh, monozygotic twins do not have identical phenotypes despite the fact that they may look alike is an indication that and um, answer A, the genotypes are not identical and this is not true because uh, the genotypes are perfectly identical and uh, of course we also can uh, cross out answer C because this is just a variant of the answer A. The genotypes or the phenotypes are not in any way due to the genotypes. So this is just uh, rephrasing uh, answer A. So this is also not correct answer. And we have uh, left only one answer, answer B. Phenotypes are result of both uh, the genotype and environmental influences. So this is true. Uh, for example, consider if you take cuttings from the plant. So this is going to be perfect uh, clones that you got by a sexual method. And if you plant them at the different elevation uh, in the mountains, for example, of course you're going to expect that... Uh, the height would be different depending on the elevation. Uh, the higher you go, the smaller the plant would be. So this is good example of the influence of the environment. Uh, those all these uh, cuttings going to be genetically perfect uh, copies of each other. Uh, so uh, the same applies to the humans. If you separate two identical twins. Uh, or monozygotic twins uh, and if you raise them at the uh, different environments you also can expect that they may look uh, slightly different due to environmental influences so answer B thank you for your attention that's all for today please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day goodbye